Hi friends, this is Mary with Sharing Kindergarten, here for a quick tech tip. Now you probably know I love iPads, probably more than most teachers, but I also know that a lot of schools are going to Chromebooks. They're cheaper, they're easier to replace, that doesn't mean they're necessarily better, but they have different functions and uses. But QR codes are, in my opinion, here to stay for quite a while in education. So how do we scan QR codes using your laptop or a Chromebook? Well, if your device has a camera, mine's up here past where my arrow is, then I can scan QR codes. So here is my tech chip, tip for the day. I'm going to go online, and I'm going to go to a website called www.webqr.com. Now this is going to open up a QR scanner using the internet, so no add-ons, no downloads. I do have to allow it to use my camera, which is kind of a safety feature. And then here I am. Hi! This is me, end of the day. Now as you can see, it opens up the camera and it allows me right here to scan QR codes. Now you have to remind your kids that they're not scanning like right here in front of them. They're going to be scanning way up high where their camera is, okay? So it just takes a few minutes to learn, just like any QR code would be. So here's a QR code I would use in my classroom. Can't see it very well. I'm going to hold it in front of my face. And this would be for Word families. So it's hard for me to record and see, so I'm going to tilt just a minute. But as you can see, it said below scanning, and then it scanned the QR code. So this is where it told me what it was right down here and then you can hit that link right there. Now this was a text code, so the text pops up over here. Pretty cool, right? So you click back over. So how can you use this in the in your classroom? Through Chromebooks, you can now scan QR codes to get your kids to the exact site you want them to go to. You can also use this, such as with my sight word stations, to self-check their work. Another way I like to do it with older kids is to give them a QR code that leads to a Google Form test. So that is just a really quick tip on how you can scan QR codes using a laptop or Chromebook in your classroom. Have a good day.